That's do the right. face <laughs> of the sound. Do the sound. Crush it. <laughs> do, do the face. Do the face. <laughs> Boxer now. Jake Paul's me name. We're boxing boys. Boxing boys. I'm gonna um, boxing boys. I'm gonna unpopular opinion here and say that uh, I respect the hustle. Yeah, I mean they're both genius fucking business masterminds. I don't even get. The I hate. would. I would never even. I would never not like when people are like they're stupid. I'm like they're not. Clearly. The, the the biggest difference between a lot of it is I think a lot of it is like decency and what is respectable and that is thrown at the window. <laughs> but because of that, there is also a layer of respect for that as well. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, what do you do? Do you ever like just respect how much of a cunt someone's capable of being? Because I mm. sometimes I wish I had like I used to when I was younger. Yeah, uh, when I, I was younger, I was like, young. Oh. You say you're forever young. I said I guess I'm mentally young. <laughs> I think you said I'm forever young. I was like, God damn, all right, dude. I'm forever young. Fifteen seconds for the rest of your life. <laughs> I need to watch Beauty and the Beast. That's what that made me think of. Yeah, when's that cartoon happening? <laughs> you could. You said you were going to do that for the second channel, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm going to do it too. Is it just? Get, are we? Do, are you doing full peanut butter? Mm -hmm. okay. I, she's literally going to sit there and she's going to be like. Gaston, why don't you just leave us alone? You think you can? <laughs> this love down. is a isn't even forbidden. It's a beautiful love. And Judge what we have, Judge Gaston. What we have, Gaston, you big brute. <laughs> and she's gonna lift up her skirt. You don't see her pussy or anything like that, but she'll yeah, like. Yeah. So, so for co for context, she is scooping peanut butter. A big family size peanut butter. Putting and her, her like hand under a dress it. and doing something with it, and then the dog Rubbing walks. The dog walks. Guess, uh, the, the, the beast is a dog. Yeah, the beast is dog. Like she's like, it's our love. And then Gaston's like, <laughs> Gaston's like, uh, Bell, what are you, what are you doing up here? And she's just like, <laughs> you always just want to separate what true love really is, Gaston. And stuff. And she's like, you know what? It's not even up to you anymore. And she's like talking. And it's like, and the dog just like kind of slowly gets up, staggered, so and just, just kind of like goes the ladybird walk. Yeah, you know, yeah, the slow. staggered little lady walk yeah. under the, under her dress and just. <laughs> I bet you're gonna say that my friends are really stupid too. And it's just like a dish set <laughs> sitting on the bricks up there. I wanted to start throwing them at him. Come on, then go. <laughs> Smash. <laughs> come on, come here, boy. I, I Why, you, why'd I you call him boy? You, I thought you said they were your friends. These dishes, and then she freaks out. Oh! <laughs> oh my God! Oh! You made me do this, Justin. <laughs> He starts freaking out. You yeah. made me do this, Gaston. You made me do it, you big brute. That's all she keeps calling. It's just a big brute. Did you write down any of the shit that we were riffing at the park? It sounds like we've still got it. Because yeah. nah, there was some really fucking jokes bits about, like, right. she was, like, laying into him and saying all this mean shit. Yeah. Like, gaslighting him. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, that's the whole thing is like the whole deal says be he's like the like the normal guy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And he's like trying to check on and that that's the whole gaslight thing. He's like, you always just want to like you always have to come up here because your ego is so small mm -hmm. and break up what true love really is. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That was definitely the gaslighting thing about it. I thought there was another dimension to it too. That was yeah. like yeah, was I just don't remember. We've all forgotten. Mm. Just need. To, I wish I was. Well, like you guys that. are so discouraging about being like. There's no way you could do it. I believe it. Mm -hmm. Huh? Yeah, I still, believe it. There's no way you put that yeah. on your main channel and yeah. you don't just get fucking but deleted. You can just blow up Papa Meat though. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> what? Are you kidding me? My channels because of what? <laughs> what did I do wrong? Yeah. The, okay. This is horseshit. The dog licking <laughs> peanut butter off Bell's pussy might. You don't you. see it, luckily, but you do hear it. And then when he gets out of the deal, he like slowly like walk, turns around. He's like, he's just on the ground like. <laughs> oh yeah, you see the like peanut butter strings. <laughs> yeah. Just goes and sits back down, and then she does it, and then he just slowly gets up and walks back. And then, uh, yeah, she's just like, oh. So what? You can take me back to that hodgepodge town where you all are suppressed. Yeah, right. I'm not going back. I already. Had. She like starts fucking rubbing it against. <laughs> yeah, just big old thing, and the dog's like. <laughs> And then she's sitting there and she's just like, why don't you just get out of here, you big brute? And then like, it's like all the licking's going on. She's like, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
fucking vile, dude. I always thought it would be funny mm. if he like killed her at the end. What happened? Oh yeah, the beast got her up there. Wasn't that something to do with the bow and arrow? Oh, he shoots the dog, and he's <laughs> and he's like, that was that was more for him than for you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So he starts screaming. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no shit. He feels bad for the dog. Yeah, he's and like, this isn't, isn't right. Better. This isn't right. <laughs> She's like, you're lucky. I, you're lucky I have peanut allergies, or else I'd be able to walk over there and slap your big brute face. <laughs> Fucking legs are all swollen up. Jesus. <laughs> These are nice. J J Jiffy peanut butter with the chunky, chunky peanut butter. <laughs> it's his favorite. It's what he I loves. Can't, I can't feel my gums. <laughs> she's like, she's looking at him doing, and then the dog underneath, like, so it's just this hodgepodge of just m mouth sounds. And I kiss him at midnight before the wilting of the last rose petal. He'll turn into a man, and we'll make love. Yeah. Even oh, though. that's right. You, she was insisting that he's a prince. Yeah, he is a prince. But she keeps talking to him like yeah. he's a dog. Like yeah, come here, boy. <laughs> oh, that's that's yeah. what I was doing. Yeah. Come here, boy. <laughs> oh, why'd you call him boy? Why'd you call him boy if he's a prince? And she's like, <laughs> huh, huh? What, what now? Why'd you call him boy if he's she a did, prince? She just goes back into gaslighting him. Like she oh, topic. so I can't call him boy. <laughs> See, your societal labels have really <laughs> put us in a lot of pressure. I can't call him boo boo or honeykins anymore, <laughs> even boy. Even scruffles, or even calm over like this. Yeah, Come on. Oh, it's, up. Up. <laughs> it's cute baby names. <laughs> Real slow, shit like that. Dude, you could do a whole series. Fucking just swap out the assets for With Jasmine and her tiger. <laughs> it's Apu, Aladdin. Oh, so I guess Aladdin, you're gonna split up what true love really is. <laughs> no, you just get the tiger. She cut, she cut Roger. Up, is it like, Roger? She like unpeels a banana and just like sticks up. Is it Roger? And she's just like, it's love, you know? It's like, it, like fucking like just foiled around and smashed She's like, out. <laughs> 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 You like the genie's just like, man, that monkey's going to town on that pussy. Hoo ah! <laughs> you ain't never ever me. Fucking retarded. Genie, what's up, buddy? I wish for Jasmine's pussy to be all sewed up and and nice and clean like it once was before. Before Abu tore into it. Like that woman who kept a chimp as a pet. Literally. Or no, no, no. It was the dentist. And the dentist is like, hey, I'm on vacation. Can you go feed my chimp? Oh, and that my, was my, another one. That was a 16-year-old chimp. It f fucked her pussy up? No, well, no. that was a woman who was had a chimp she was fucking. And then eventually what? the chimp ripped Whoa. her face off. <laughs> yeah, I heard it from Joe Rogan, so I mean, Whoa. say no it's, more. It have, have to be believable then. No, I was talking <laughs> about the one where it's like this dentist guy. He was like this guy that was just like, yeah, he's on vacation. Hey, can you go over and feed my chimp? And she's like, hey, hey okay. <laughs> Goes over there and it just rips off her face, tears off her arms, gouges out her eyeballs and everything. <laughs> yeah, and she went on Oprah. Mm -hmm. She went on Oprah. She had like a veil over her face because her face, and then they unveil it. Because mm. it's just like horrifying. They had to like, let, like hey. She blatantly doesn't wear that veil ever either. Mm. Oprah's blatantly like, okay, what we're going to do is we're going to put a fucking veil on you. So when we reveal how hideous you are, Good it's even ratings. more impactful. Good she's like, ratings. do I have to wear the veil? Or I guess she's more like, because she's got no fucking tongue. This and then Oprah like, forces a goddamn... This is, this is <laughs> an explicit 10 minutes so far. <laughs> hey, it's a, it's a test run. If this gets demonetized, your thing is definitely there fucked. That's yeah, true. Yeah, that's yeah. true. It's a little uh, proving ground. That's true. I guess if you got... The woman probably had no idea. She was when on Oprah. In Beauty and the Beast, well, that's true. <laughs> she you're, was, you're on Oprah. Oh, I'm sure. Oh, I didn't think she was an unbeliever. I just think she's basically a vegetable. She's, she's like, see no evil, hear no evil. <laughs> hey, Don. Speak no Easy. evil. <laughs> the, uh, in Beauty and the Beast, is it all about, like, why does Belle go up to the castle? Do you guys remember? Doesn't she get, like, chased true? off the road by wolves? No, he, she goes up there on purpose, I think. Classic dumb bitch move. Yeah. Or is she trying? Or 
she trying to like? I heard there's a monster up in there. I'm gonna change him. Wasn't it about her father or something? So like, didn't his uh, dad get chased off the road by wolves? And she or goes something. to save him, and maybe that was like, at the end. She goes up to see like, is my dad here? See, I thought that her Papa? dad. I thought her dad though was like Gaston. You gotta go up there and save my beautiful bride. You've gotta kill daughter. the beast. I think it's understandable that he'd want to kill the literal monster in the castle. I'm 100% team Gaston. Gaston was a fucking Chad, too. He was. I liked how slicked back his hair was. Yeah. Just like fucking as 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 flat as it could possibly be into like a pony. He had ball. a very Spaniard look about him. Was he trying to fuck Bill? Oh, yeah. Yeah, sure. I mean, for sure. I don't look at a man like that. Mm -hmm. Bill was definitely Bell. The, most, was the hottest chick in town, and then Gaston was definitely the hottest guy. Mm -hmm. He was like, it's It was like, a, yeah, a match made in heaven. I thought that the human version of the beast looked fucked compared to the the monster version. Yeah, his nose is all fucked up. He looked like an incel. <laughs> that was my original. <laughs> he owns a castle. That was my original bit I was going to do about mm -hmm. uh, Be the Beast is that the. He like goes out, and it looks like uh, you're just an incel. Like a he's fucking like, incel. He's like, kiss me, Bill. Yeah, love for me. Kiss me. Mm. And she's like, no, that's okay. Hi, can yes. you turn back? I liked you more when you were. Yeah, he looks fucked. See, he he's look got fucked. like a Peggy Hill nostrils. Let me see. Uh, yeah, he just looks fucked. Peggy J. Looks mm -hmm. like a. Let's just. Fuck me. Hey! That beast. Yeah, that was a transition. <laughs> <laughs> you know, just because you shave all your fur off doesn't make you a woman. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. It's such a bad joke. I know! That's why it's so funny. You're like, you wouldn't believe what I read on... You wouldn't even believe what I read in the mug club today from Louder with Crowder. <laughs> Disney. <laughs> uh, Revitalize. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we have to do some serious fucking editing on this podcast, dude. Nah, it's good. I am curious though now about the the story structure for, because she like goes into the castle and she just kind of stays there. I don't think she's ever held captive. Classic. Do you think she was fucking the beast the whole time? Obviously. The whole time. The Getting whole time, fucking yeah. railed by that big furry monster. Mm. Ooh! Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> She's like... <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> Just taking it so she can stay in his castle. Classic. <laughs> She's like, let me, let me see her face. Don't look at me! Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> 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 Do you reckon it's the kind of thing, though, where he, like, you know when people adopt fucking crocodiles or, like, a hippo for five years, they're fine, and then they drag you into the water and eat you? Do you reckon it's uh, kind of that situation? How long was the beast a beast, though? Because this is this would go into that. Because if he's a beast for a long time, then I feel like he would adapt to that. I just imagine whilst he's railing her, the animalistic instincts take over and he just fucking, like, her face off. I feel like it would be more like, she's like, just eating put, her just carcass. put on the condom real quick. She's like, no! No! Can you imagine the kind of STDs he'd have? Just dog been with his big fucking whatever he can find in the forest the whole time. <laughs> deer and stuff. Yeah, like he's chasing down deer and just like... <laughs> if you're that much of a like loner incel in a castle, you are going to so get fucked. And you're so already brrr. like an animal. <laughs> it doesn't so take much to convince yourself. It's pretty odd there's all these pregnant deers running around the forest. Oh, what? Hmm? But I haven't seen a buck in two odd years. <laughs> he's like, what the hell's going on? <laughs> yeah, it's a weird hybrid. We keep the people in the village just see flocks of deers trying to like leave wolf the deer. area. <laughs> wolf the, deer. The, the deer are right, the well, wolf deer. <laughs> yeah. This, yeah, the hybrid deer. The, of those spring. are the weir. The weir, the giant uh, weir. There's like a guy stopping by town. And he's just like watching like people talk about it. They're like, yep, those are the weir. Look at it over there. It's like a puppy with like antlers. And the person's just like, <laughs> just like, a, uh, mm hmm. All right. Ranj. Did he transform to the moon or was he just always like that? Was it like a werewolf thing? No, I think he was like, he was cursed on it. What was the thing? Cursed by the, some evil witch. And it was like a flower or something. Yeah, yeah he had like a, a rose in a. I thought he was the beast for like a thousand years, though. No, I don't it, think it's that. Was yeah, it only like, fucked. Was it only like was... a year or something? I don't know. Because he just had plant, like a it flower. It was only until all the, point, the petals fell off, so it must have not have been that long. I well, thought, it's a magic flower. It's in a, like, he keeps it in a thing, right? Yeah, the glass case. So maybe that preserves it some. 
Right. We're obviously very. We don't know what we're. We talking have about no here. idea. So if anything, let's write our own ending or the own mm-hmm. version of it. I think that would be a pretty interesting take. So Bell if, gets viciously raped is what would happen. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, how about we make it just a little more PG, and mm. instead of. Uh, because we have no idea how the rose... Is it supposed to be when the rose is completely healed? Because no, it, it would make sense no, when the petals... It was when before all the, the petals, petals... When all the petals fall off, I think. When all the petals fall off, he's stuck like that forever. Yeah, yeah. He That's why to, he's got to get a kiss of true love or some yeah, shit. Yeah, he has to grow. Oh, so with the kiss of true was, love. He was heartless It's before. Shrek. How did she, yeah. uh, well, Shrek how, how did she prove her, her love? Well, they, um, they kiss. Yeah. So she's just like, you know what, you big, you, you big stinky dog. I don't care that you're a big stinky dog. It's basically your cartoon. Oh, you're stinky. And then she kisses him and he turns into a, He's like, ew. No, no, no. Turn she's, back. No, she was all like, she was like, oh my God, you're so handsome. And then Gaston shows up and he just fucking loads one off right in his face. Just boom. <laughs> I saved you, my queen. His fucking brains all over the wall. Gaston, no. We're married. That's how it would be in the real mm. life. <laughs> and what <laughs> what age was this set? Like, it had to have been 16, like, 17, probably, probably 17 or 18. Uh, it seemed more like 1700s to me. Yeah. Like the, the ponytails with the ribbon in it makes me think of. Oh, um, yeah, like colonial kind of deal. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Except that we're, what? Yeah, so we're, so like we, France we, or something? We or past or throwing brides over our shoulders. And yeah. I don't think so. Come on! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. She's like, no, beast! His fucking teeth are just all over the place. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The fucking the pots and the pots and dishes and shit are like transforming back like <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna be my bro It would be so f- sick if Gaston was just like a big fucking sweaty redneck guy. Oh I shot him in the head, huh? That makes him a little less romantic, right? I don't think he was ever much romantic, was he? Yeah, the song at the beginning is like, oh, Gaston, he's so strong and so big. But Belle was never interested, and we see the film through the eyes of Belle. That is true. And all those other chicks are literally painted as, like, paint-by-the-numbers retard yeah, yeah, bitches. Yeah, but we're rewriting. Oh, that's right. That's right, because there was a deal, like, all the other chicks want to fucking suck and fuck Gaston. Yeah, and Belle's like, like, I'm different. I like dog dick. I can yeah. read. That's her. <laughs> I can read, Gaston, and I read you, and guess what, buddy? Your book is stupid. <laughs> I thought the burn was going to be much better. If I was Gaston, I'd be like, sick burn. <laughs> you can read, huh? I hope you know that I'm going to smother you in your sleep. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, whatever. Well, don't talk to me unless you have a bright red dick like a little dog, like a little pup. <laughs> She's like, what is your fucking obsession with, <laughs> yeah, with like, dogs? It's like, fucking Fuck stop. off. <laughs> fuck off, Gaston. Yeah, g- fuck off, Gaston. You don't know me. It's Gaston! <laughs> Gaston, you bitch! Yeah, okay, yeah, well, Gaston. I'm for some dog dick. She looks, he's like a poodle walk by. She's like, hey. <laughs> oh my hey. god. Then <laughs> Gaston's dad walks up. He's like, well, Gaston, I understand that Belle's the hottest piece of pussy in town, but <laughs> she's not she right in loves, the head. <laughs> she's not right in the head, and she likes dog dick. Why don't you <laughs> settle with one of these toothless retards over here to the right? And he's like, <laughs> he's like, ugh. Dude, they were hot. What about huh? The tri- the triplets? <laughs> they were like all fucking big tit, big lips, blonde. Why did he not like them then? That just seems like right up his alley. I think it's the like, you know, she don't want me, therefore. Uh, well, what would she can't have? Mm. Yeah. Oh, I want that. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> she like, oh, I wish at one dick. point in the movie would have said that. She's like walking away, holding like a dog's hand, and they're like walking off. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, God damn, I want that. She probably was a freak. Like, oh, yeah. Like maybe that was the, mm. those prissy kids, you know, those girls. Yeah. Couldn't live up to Belle's freakiness. Yeah, like all the other girls are like, oh, I'm only a missionary and I want to look at you the whole time. Yeah, and she's like, do me from behind like yeah, a dog. dog. Like doggy style. She's like, riff, riff, yeah. riff, 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 like, riff, Oh riff, my riff. God, I'm going to come fuck. <laughs> <laughs> he has a fucking shot corner. <laughs> oh my God, that's so fucking hot. Yeah, I think that was probably it. Beauty and the Beast from Disney, who brought you Hunchback of Notre Dame and other classics like The Black Cold. No, that's probably a bad one. The, the best, <laughs> the, the most revered Disney movie, The Black Cauldron. I thought you remember it really. No, it was. I think it did really bad. If mm-hmm. I remember right. I remember I liked the only reason I liked it as a kid was because there was a sick, he like, breathed, he like breathed green fire and it was like a big black dragon. It's fucking crazy. It looked demonic as shit. What was, was he? The princess's name was like Ilanwi. Hersha? Or so. I think it was something fucking weird. Yeah. What's, what's Queen, Princess Hersha. 
Huh? <laughs> like a big, like a, <laughs> Patricia. I don't, I don't catch the reference. No, I just mentioned that's my grandma's ugly. name. Ugly uh, girl names. Uh, gross name. Mm. Yeah. Your grandma's name's Patricia? Yeah. How about she's ugly as shit? Mm-mm. No, she's not. <laughs> she's she's Mm-mm. a smoke show. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> Woo! I want to go to grandma's house. Tom, stop! I want to go to grandma's house! <laughs> Grandma makes the best cookies. Tom! She makes good pavlova. I don't know Lots of is. cream. Okay. <laughs> all right, dude, easy. <laughs> I know you added a, that in there for effect, all right? And I don't like it. Right. She wears my <laughs> shoes. <laughs> huh? We went and we had the same pair of shoes. You and my grandma uh, did, yeah. yeah, yeah. You have shape ups? <laughs> no. Was, I had like these leather, just, ca- just casual men's leather shoes. She was wearing almost exactly the same shoes. She said, I like your shoes. Did you and get, I, well, did you get that at the man's store? Mm-hmm. No, I got it at oldlesbianwarehouse.com. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, you said you got this at the man's it's store. Sick, dude. Sick. It was good. Yeah. Yeah, no. Yeah, your grandma's a lesbian. She's an English rose. Mm-hmm. I didn't hear nothing else about it. Wilted and drowning in tea. No. Mm. What does English rose look like? She did age tremendously. Vibrant. Well. She, yeah, she's she's like a movie grandma. <laughs> she did age tremendously. All right, now yeah. I'm getting uncomfortable. Yeah. She aged really. Well. <laughs> Let's call it like I see it, dude. Like Straight a Gucci I caught, handbag. I caught, I caught like I see it. <laughs> I saw your grandma bend over and pick some stuff up one time. The patina on your grandma is <laughs> God damn. That age good. That beaver don't look too old. <laughs> That's fresh beef. Yes, fresh beef indeed. Oh, I haven't seen her in a while. You walk into her, you walk into her kitchen, you're like, you baking sourdough bread in here? She's like, no. no? You're like, mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Fifth Street Market, god damn. Fifth Street mm. Market. Woo! Ugh. Mm. <laughs> Told me so I think your friend is being a tad bit too friendly to to grandma. My grandpa would have fucked Don up. What do you mean by that? What happened? Yeah. I said he would have. Yeah. What if happened? you tried if you tried to go down fucking Fifth, oh, Fifth Street oh, Market. Yeah, your grandpa. My grandpa yeah. would have decked you, bro. Yeah. He didn't really know what was going on. I was there. Your grandpa was as blind as a goddamn <laughs> bat. Patricia! <laughs> he's sitting there. He's sitting there. Patricia! He, he, he keeps making sourdough bread references, and your grandpa's like, mm, that sounds good. I like sourdough oh, bread. Patricia. I like it too. Patricia! <laughs> Why does it smell of mackerel in here? Are we having sex? <laughs> <laughs> I know, know that smell. Is this, is this what sex like? Am I? Are you thrusting? <laughs> <laughs> My grandpa was less like, her, oh, more like, eh. Like that. <laughs> Yeah, bloody, bloody right. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's good. Yeah. Is this what the youth call pegging, Patricia? I do. I find it quite exhilarating, actually. I didn't wipe my ass, so it should slip right in. Grandpa died <laughs> last year. R.I.P. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> dementia, as it happens. Yep. yep. He had the old silly brain, and then <laughs> fell in the ground. <laughs> I had to watch his funeral via a stream because of the pandemic. It was very heartbreaking. <laughs> yeah, but you didn't tell me. You why? Tell, what? It's you none of your tell business. Me, yeah, I, see, I guess not. <laughs> not and that's that's business. why it has to be joked about today. Yeah, this yeah. is how our, our people deal with grief. You know what you'd have done? You'd have made no jokes. You'd have been Come like, "Come on, dude." You'd be like, "Oh, it's man. too fucking soon." Yeah. <laughs> stop! Stop joking. <laughs> You'd have been like, oh, dude, I'm so sorry. And I'd have been like, hey, bro, how are you I, doing? I, you okay? I, uh, I did say that. And then you said, oh, he's been dead for a while. Yeah. It's, it's the just, same day. So, Inwardly. As soon as his brain went, he was. <laughs> yeah, it was just so, a mm-hmm. meat sack carrying, mm-hmm. you know. I don't think he said much when I was there either. Probably offended point. by your very presence. <laughs> <laughs> Get this fucking <laughs> top out top of here. Get it. <laughs> <Get out. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> right away, Granddad. All right, Granddad. Do, do you want to go down to the pub? Yeah. What'd you guys do in England? Whenever you're there, like, what'd you do? What'd you do? Which time? Mm-hmm. Well, I don't know any of them. Like, were you ever like, hey, you you ready to go to do this? We really do. I mean, your dad took us to see some castles. We were. I mean, we fucking went across the whole of Europe. Yeah, that's right. not I nothing. Mean, no, 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 no. In, in I England mean, like, I guess, specifically, though. I meant like more like if you were like sitting there, if he was like, if he was there for like a couple months, you're just like, well, it's Thursday. You you want to you ready to go do this? What the fuck did we do in Portsmouth when we were there? Because <clears> that was the second time. The first time we came, we went and like, like almost nothing. 
What, the first time or the, the second, second time? second time. I don't remember what we did for any of them, honestly. I, th I think the second time we... I went for two works and we, I really only remember working and, like, drawing that thing for Jenkins. And we visited that Jenkins. Was just a couple of days. What else oh, yeah, we, we went down to... We saw Jenkins. We... What else did we do, though? Did like, you go to London and all? We went... When we saw Jenkins, I think. We would, yeah. Because he was in London. Yeah, yeah, it wasn't really... I don't know. Probably mm -hmm. nothing. Mm -hmm. He loved it. It was great. Good trip. I think that was the time we saw you, Grandma. Oh, there you go. Mm -hmm. They remember that. <laughs> hey, they just, mm -hmm. I they that said I didn't do well. nothing. Yeah. Don't say you didn't do anything. You fucked my grandma. Yeah, you had the time of your life. <laughs> remember that? Oh, that's right. Patty! <laughs> are we having sex? <laughs> did you say Patty? I smell. What did he call her? But just Patricia? Yeah, I mean, no. if you had have said Patty, you'd have been out of that house. <laughs> <laughs> my grandma is a proud woman. <laughs> <laughs> Get him out of here! Hold me, Patty. He called her Patty. She hates like nanny or nan or gran or granny. It's grandma, it's and that's grandma. it. Hey, old bitch. <laughs> She's like, oh. She would prefer that to granny or nanny or whatever. I had uh, I have some grandma. cousins that call my grandma Omar, and it makes me want to fucking pull my eyes out. It's like a Omar. black man's name. <laughs> okay. No. No. Omar. 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 No, Omar. You're <laughs> it's, it's just in the R's missing from English English. Yeah. Wait, is that a black black yeah. bloke's name? <laughs> Omar? Yeah. Like o Omar Johnson. <laughs> is it anyways, what are you saying? I just fucking it was annoying. Omar and Opa. I was like Ooh. I was like, just fucking call him grandma and grandpa. What the fuck is wrong with you? Opa. It's special. I don't get it. Opa. Isn't, isn't I think it's Native Oma's, American. I think sure. Oma. Are you Native American? No, my hippie grandma, you know, yeah. hippie stuff. Gross. My grandma has the good mom. sense to be an old Christian woman. <laughs> an old English Christian woman doesn't try and be anything else. It was my dad's mom. She's like, I, I don't believe in any of the nonsense at the church, but, you know, it's quite peaceful there. I'm like. Good woman. She says she goes to church. She doesn't believe in it, but it's peaceful. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, yeah I don't. I don't find that cool. There's, this, there's. I a, say stand by your beliefs. There's a woman who's kind well, of like a hardcore Christian that like, talks to my grandma on the phone. My grandma's always tells me how she like trolls her. <laughs> it's really quite 2008 amazing atheist energy, but I'm usually here for it because it's funny <laughs> to me. She trolls her. Oh, but she wouldn't believe how I trolled that dumb old bitch. <laughs> it's not far off. She's a troll. Well, my grandma is kind of like that. He shoots from the hip. <laughs> Are you going to be on CSGO later or no? <laughs> God's a f <laughs> Beep! <laughs> Got him. Yeah, damn yeah. whore! <laughs> well, it's 3.30. Time for bed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. These are... Cause yeah, these are phone calls at 5.30 in the morning. She was taking the piss out of me uh, before... Like, when I got my place... Uh, or when I got the place I'm renting... It's like a... It's like a... Probably the nicest place I've ever lived. And in, mm. in like still here. Oh, okay. Yeah, here. So, and I, you know, sent video to the family, and then I hadn't spoken to her for a long time, and she was like, um, "I spoke to her after the, a while." I was like, "Oh, did God? The last time we spoke, the fucking snowstorm hadn't happened." She was like, "Oh yes, I heard you sent lots of pictures of your place round to the family. Thought you'd really made it. Thought you were on top of the world. And next thing I hear, you're eating snow." <laughs> <laughs> like, all right, Granny, <laughs> you fucking. <laughs> <laughs> Her yeah. house is awesome, though. It's like in the Shire. Yeah, it's like well, her house is nice. I don't think it's yeah. about, like, my place versus her place. Oh, okay, okay. That's exactly what it's about, Tom. It sounds that way. Yeah. You'd, be like, you'd be like, oh, it's a lot better than your fucking raggedy-ass house. <laughs> oh, Tom, is this how you want to fight? Then let's go. But the way they found first had a hint that my grandpa had, like, dementia was he mm. fucking put a hole in the ceiling with his gun. <laughs> Apparently he was showing it off to some people. Was like, <laughs> 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 Fuck! <laughs> Who was that? Yeah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> He's there. <laughs> what kind of? What kind of? What kind of gun did he have? Who two? What? Oh, okay. No, he said gun, not ballerina dress. <laughs> 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 When are we going to finish this set? That's what we should talk about. Well, it's not finished about it. You always say this, but it looks <clears throat> perfect. 
I it resembles after you showing me that thing, I actually do want it. Even if we keep them really light, I want to do something to the brick. Just that's that's pretty sweet, huh? Yeah, that's pretty sweet. Yeah, I want to paint just like weather the brick somehow. I mean, it can still look like it was. You're talking about weathering the bricks for a while, though. Yeah, I was talking about painting them at all. (coughs) Well, isn't just just fucking do it? Isn't Justin Mm -hmm. supposed to come up and fucking? You've been make the deal. You've been hogging, Justin. Don't say you, not me, bro. Your whore wife, mm-hmm. who you, you are subsidizing to mm-hmm. hog Justin. You reckon he's banging her whilst you're at work? Mm-hmm. I told her this chicken coop's wear, taking a while to fucking build. Fucking, hey, wear protection. That's all I said. Hey, baby, I know you got needs. Yeah. Hey, that's. I thought you guys said it was, the walls were supposed to go up today. There's like nothing done. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She's like, oh yeah, no, we uh, we had to go back to the drawing board. We had to go to the Home Depot. We were running around a lot today. That's why I'm sweaty and disheveled. Why is there? Why is the bed all sweaty and the frames all broken up? What's up with that? Uh we fell into it earlier. Okay, baby. Well, whatever you need, you need more money for supplies. That's how I say it. Mm-hmm. You would have to worry though, wouldn't you? Justin's pretty handsome. Uh, when, when do we get him back to finish this? Well, I don't know. He's got to build a truck. He's got to build a. What we need to do, honestly, mm-hmm. what would be a good start is just filling these walls. Three hours ago, this podcast was over. And now we're about to spend three thousand dollars on a truck. Yeah, that's gonna it's like having kids. It's gonna keep us all together. <laughs> you know, I like that. Mm-hmm. All right, you're just gonna be paying the asses whenever this lease is up, and we have to move all this shit out. We just pay on to do it. I, I mean, we're just gonna have to get like a garbage chute and throw it all out the window because mm. <laughs> it's not coming down in one piece. You're just gonna have to bust it up and start over wherever we go. Oh, so. we're staying together <clears throat> wherever we go. <clears throat> well. Why don't we just do a curveball and go somewhere totally out of everyone's minds, like Saudi Arabia or something? I'd rather stay in the country. I would. I already did it. What well, you guys can do it too. All right, it's your turn to move continent. We're gonna set up shop in fucking Bulgaria. All right, dude. I'll meet you there. Go ahead. Okay. I'll see you. I'll see you there. That would actually be really funny if you did that move. And I'm like, Tom, sorry, bro. Um, that was a joke. I'm not going. <laughs> I I was convinced even the day you said you were coming that you weren't coming and it was all a fucking ruse. You never know mm. what to expect from me, buddy. Even when I saw you at the door, I was like, in three days, he's got a return flight. Mm. And he's yeah, gone. That would have been really funny. Yeah. But nope, you never know what to expect from me. I know. Earlier, uh, Sacred Viewer, we went through a drive through coffee place and Hunter told the man... At the I don't go- know why you think this is such like a... Because a- we have to go back there. Okay. And at some point, that man is going to be like, "I can always say clearly, you're not a, a, an electrician." What? How would he ever not know? Because we clearly do not dress, act, or have the schedules of electricians and the activities we my, do at the he coffee know shop. My business. He doesn't know my whereabouts. Wow, these electricians sure do like art. Yeah, well, that's my main passion. But my dad owns this business. It's just a surefire way to just save up money for a while. Uh huh. You're a liar. Know? You come to this shop and you lie, and now you're banned forever. <laughs> and get your four-eyed fucking friend out of here too. Man, and that's what's like, gonna happen. I like that place. So... That will that will not happen. <laughs> you keep going there, man. That won't happen. That yeah, won't it will happen. happen. You'd be awkward. Don't You'd be it. awkward as hell as if mm. he says like, "Well, you guys aren't electricians," and I'd be like, "I have to know that every time yeah, he I makes am. me a coffee, he's muttering in the back of his head." It's not a fucking. No fucking electrician. He's got light and fucking. If you think that's gonna happen, this is how society falls. If you think that happens, we need rules and social contracts that are adhered to, or everything crumbles. If you think that's happening every time, look at him and be like, "Yep, got a full day ahead. Just stopping for some coffee for a little bit at one p.m." Yeah, we did. We did go in at four thirty, and you told him we were on lunch. It's true. Funny. Yeah, it's like he was like, "Why are you starting work at twelve p.m., Mister Electrician?" And you were like, "Living a vida loca, bro." (laughs) (laughs) No, no, he's like. uh, He's like, hey, welcome back. And I'm like, yep, just on lunch, which could refer to any kind of break for food. Mm-hmm. So we had a, he's like, late start. Oh, I hate those days. You have to dread it all through the morning. And I say, yep. And then next thing you know, and so he thinks my day started at one. Mm-hmm. So three hours into my shift, hey, break time. Works out perfectly. Well, to be honest, it is a pretty believable number. Like, I know an Also, it's just like, his, hi, his, I'm a, I'm a human like being. Works. I'm, you know, it'd be different if I was a 55 year old man and I was dressed like this. Yep, but I'm an mm. electrician. Because if anything, he's just like, well, I'm not going to call that guy. Because that guy's a 55 year old man with a gate creeper shirt on and some fucking shorts. Don't tell me you're not going to be a 55 year old man with a gate creeper t shirt. You want to try saying that again? Don't tell me you wouldn't be a 55 year old man with a gate creeper t shirt and uh, shorts. <laughs> 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 <fall> back. 
You understood where I was going with it. <laughs> Barely. Uh, Barely, but because it's just I've become so conditioned to that fucking hobgob tongue you call an accent <laughs> <laughs> where I have to decipher it in real time. I do sometimes like how you have to pause for just half a second before you respond. You're like, yeah, okay. Just a little. Blah, like, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. In my head and then. Ching. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So that, uh, I don't see why not. It's so much easier because then if I would have said, oh, I'm an animator. Every time you come in, hey, cartoon guy. What if that started happening? Then I'll I would be, never want to be go happy back. with that. That did happen at Chipotle. That uh, didn't happen at fucking Chipotle. Hunter got recognized at Chipotle. By everyone. By everyone. We were, it, we he walked in the there. door and everyone was like, that's yeah. not true. Man, you guys more or less. Like Those two guys are so lucky to be friends with me. <laughs> <laughs> Over there eating lunch. Me, Kenny's entourage. Man, wow. I wish- Dude, I wish he was my I friend. I felt such tension <laughs> after I sat down and the two guys asked to be with me. And then my, Don, my, I, Don, my thought Don process and, was really, literally, how do I not create tension and not seem like I'm jealous? <laughs> by looking, because I'm by, not, Hunter. I'm like, not jealous. I look like a fucking psychopath. <laughs> you're just like this. Like, literally like this. <laughs> 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 just slowly, just the mouth mm-hmm. sounds coming from Don. <laughs> the the breath, like just <laughs> the, the hey, 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 y'all, hey, 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 meat candy. How's, I just wonder like how, how the food guy is. Snuck, yeah, that yeah, guy snuck how, around to how, the how soda did, machine. How did it turn out for you? How's like the, the foot? As if it was the off the assembly line. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Yeah, Who's you a guys. Nice guy? I cooked it myself. Do you like it? <laughs> you know, well, to be fair, he was the guy chopping. He was the guy meat. actually chopping. Oh, yeah, fair yeah, enough. Yeah. Fair enough to that guy. I liked mm-hmm. him, too. He seemed like They were all cute. nice. They yeah. were all very nice people back there. Yeah. Seething. Especially because I was like, I, I did feel uncomfortable with those two things. And they and then you guys were like walking past me and shit. And then while I was eating, then the, the chick came up and asked to take a picture too. And I, and oh, I didn't realize. The and then first, he went, I, you know, I love your videos. Oh my God. The first the first thing I literally did was I like did. And looked over at Don. And he was just like. <laughs> and then Tom's like, I can take the picture. I'm like, oh, for God. Oh, God. Yeah. Sorry I will say I friends. did. I did feel mm-hmm. an odd amount of tension from me too. There was there was actually no tension. No, I did I, not I, care. No, okay, just, yeah. Just, as long as everyone knows. <laughs> yeah. Tom, I got Tom's other slides. Like, I used to yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just chewing my fucking gum. <laughs> Blood coming out of your mouth. <laughs> I, I haven't been. I was happy to let the whole thing pass we, by, and then you said something, so I had to make the entourage comment because mm-hmm. I was just happy I didn't to let say it. Anything. What are you <laughs> I don't remember. I, didn't I just say remember anything. my snappy comeback, and no, you'd be like, "Shut the fuck up!" Literally, I literally sat down and I got like, out my food. And you're that was like, pretty cool, right? And you, and you no, no, <laughs> yeah, the fuck. <laughs> right. You're like, hey, that was yeah. pretty cool. That was pretty <laughs> sweet. No, I I sat there and I literally got my food, and then Tom was like. You can't go anywhere without getting <laughs> recognized. That's true. You said. We've been like 70 establishments and everyone's like... <laughs> okay, first off, they don't... They don't. <laughs> yeah. What? Yeah, I mean, hey. We, we literally can't go anywhere. It used to happen to me. Back with in the show quest days, Tom. We got to bring back show quest and BTS. We... It, at the height of so our the, power, did Chipotle. not get recognized half as much as no, Hunter. No, to, in, our, in fairness, we but look I, like I normal see, people. Hey, I have a giant hey, fucking hey, mullet. Easy, dude. Mm-hmm. You this see, is, this is a nice haircut. Even the coffee man was like, nice mullet, dude. And you were like, oh, thank you. Yeah. I, you know what? I'm, I'm an electrician. Hey, sorry that you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm just a, hey, I'm a go, I'm just I'm an a average go, electrician. I'm a go getter. I'm a go getter electrician. I'm going to taste that man's spit in my coffee. I like it. It's gonna be your fault. You pop off the lid. That actually sucks so bad. They pop off the lid. It's a fucking there. loogie. <laughs> On top. <laughs> yep. Oh, they, this, this is our life now, Don. Mm, that's not true. We, we're hype, man. And then, and then, whenever I thought it was uncomfortable, I sat there and I was like, "Man, it's gonna be sweet." Whenever we do the cream crew thing. <laughs> <laughs> but I am stoked for that because it'll be sweet whenever everybody comes up and then you know what's going to be the best part about that is people are going to come up and they're going to be like, hey, Tom, I love you. <laughs> I hate those two other losers, blah, blah. I always thought, I think you're the funniest. You're going to have comments like that. And then the two people who, when you get that, it's mm-hmm. going to be the, the two people are going to stand there and like look at the person like, mm-hmm. like scold you down. They're going to turn around and have Tom on their jackets. 
That would actually be sweet. Yeah. I'd be like, that's fucking Stop weird. Stop buttering me up. It's, it's fucking weird. Me? Yeah. Okay, dude. I'm not a croissant. Take I, your butter elsewhere. I have I, I have no uh, rebuttal then. No. I have nothing to say. That's right. I There is nothing I can say. Correct. That's what happens when you're wrong. We're going to rebrand. We're going to rebrand <laughs> after we're done recording. And then, you know what? It's, uh, hey, look at our faces! It lit a fire under dude, me. Dude, the funny face! Dude, you have to recognize <laughs> me. <laughs> the funny face. <laughs> no, a that's... Tear. that's, that's shit. Do the funny face with the sound! Do the sound! Rush it! Do do the face! Do the face! (laughs) That's just Don. That's Don. That's just Don right next to me. Screaming at me. Do the sound, Tom! Pushing him fucking harder. (laughs) Grabbing him by the fucking shoulders. Giving him like whiplash and shit. Do it! Do it! Imagine being at Comic Con in front of three thousand people, we did this. Uh, and Don's like this. It's, you're right; everyone forgot. It was, I, no, okay, it was it was not three thousand people. <laughs> it was maybe uh, two hundred, maybe two hundred. Felt oh, like three thousand in the, in the dark. <laughs> like I saw rows and rows of faces. We we were silhouetted by our unicorn hoods. You couldn't see our faces. The uh. So did he actually look at you? Because I feel like he did. Yeah, like, he was like, like this. He's like, I thought I thought he would do this. I thought it was gonna be something like, and uh, we're Flash gets. <laughs> 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 but he, you you turn you turned to him and you <laughs> you smiled. <laughs> it was like a shot from Peep Show. Okay, I can still see it in my head. Hey, I've already explained this. I regret instigating it, but once you instigate it, you can't back down. It's me or you, No, man. but what I'm saying is... It's not me it's or you! Me or it's you both had, of us! You, you held the we die! Yeah, we yeah, both yeah. die like, in this fire! Uh-huh, uh-huh. That's great. That's you're like, that's you're a pa- you whilst you're tied to me on the fucking <laughs> witch's pyre. Uh-huh. Well, okay, Dropping okay, the gasoline and match. It's either we both go down, or I go down super hard. <laughs> So I'm picking both. You didn't go harder. super. T- you if I, if I back down, if I said that's do super the, hard, I said, do the sound. That's super. Then... Not fucking line. Was it a long in time? front of three thousand uh, people? Yeah, How yeah. long was the gap? Whenever you're like, do, and, I literally said, do sound. You like this? Who knows? I literally in, said, in, in, etern- in eternity, a <laughs> lifetime. I literally said, ah, I'm not gonna do that, man. I'm not gonna do it. Yeah, do I said it. into the mic, ah, I'm not gonna so do that. So that was over the speed. Yeah, yeah, like this. I was like, I'm, I'm not gonna do the sound. Just do it. <laughs> hey, we're we're important, Tom. We was that pre or post races, Mario? I think it may have been post. pre. I think it might have been pre. We wouldn't get invited to fucking Comic Con off the back of No Race of Mario. That's such a classic story, dude. I love that shit. I really hope that in the future we can have some con stuff like that. I really hope in the future you guys can make fucking absolute asses of yourselves. And I can be there to laugh about it for years <laughs> later. <laughs> I'm wondering who's going to... You're I, an open book. I feel like I'm going to uh, shit my pants on <laughs> some kind of stage. I'm just like profusely sweating. Mm-hmm. So what's it like working with these guys? It's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> big baggy ass <laughs> basketball shorts on. A big fucking turd just falls out. I look around like... <laughs> you're a natural performer though man I feel like you'd fucking <laughs> lap it off is that my off. shit <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. go off stage go off stage covering the big fucking wet brown spot on my ass <laughs> go off stage I feel like that would only help you and add to your legend <laughs> dude that was so when you took a shit on I stage that was you. crazy I I seriously <laughs> fuck that guy dude <laughs> <laughs> I, I would say that if I, if I went to so like if I went to Kansas City Comic Con and Sean Aston shit himself, <laughs> and, he was, I ha- and I was in line, I had like a fucking Rudy or Lord of the Rings poster for him to sign. And he's just like uh, Sean Aston. <laughs> Sean Aston actually had to cancel because he shit himself. I'd be like, what a big fucking dopey idiot! <laughs> How are you an adult? And yeah, but yeah, like, but your whole brand is ooh, like. Ooh, yeah. He runs out of that signing tent. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Sean, John. He's just like, oh, oh, <laughs> falls to the ground. <laughs> Imagine also he like doesn't tell anybody and he's like wearing like big pants or you can't, you know, tell or something. And he just fucking <laughs> reeks of shit the whole time. 
Yeah, Sean Aston was really nice, but he just smelled terrible. <laughs> That's the route I would take. Did someone fart? It was a convention hall, buddy, probably. <laughs> just have a big steamy pile of your, shit in my pants. Your whole brand is grimy and poopy. So I think it would <laughs> I don't work think, out. Though, as a respectable person, you would shit yourself. You're not a respectable person. That's what I wanted, man. You're an animator. That's yeah. true. They'd be like, <laughs> you fuck, I can't believe you did that. That was awesome. <laughs> exactly. Every time we go to Chipotle, like, hey, you, you, want, you want some brown sauce? Yeah, it'd be yeah, every time. That would be, uh, uh, that would really, really affect me emotionally. <laughs> if somebody was like, if I went to fucking Chipotle, it was like, you want some brown sauce, Mr. Captain Poopy Pants? You'd be like, and, I'm like, thanks, man. I would go in my car and I fucking punch my steering wheel as hard as I could <laughs> until the airbag fucking deployed my face. Yeah, getting brown stuff all over you. It'd be just oh, 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 I was gonna eat it. Bad film. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. What would be the first convention that you, we go to? We could go to the Dallas one. No, uh, I mean I'd go. Well, you don't sound very thrilled. Wouldn't like be happy about it, but I'd go. Would it'd you be, be happy like about it? It'd be like would bowling. Be I would go. <laughs> you know your uh, your your hatred for bowling is coming out of nowhere, and I feel personally attacked. Well, your love for bowling came out of nowhere. So there's not one convention where you're like that would I'd be stoked to go to that. I would like to go to Lightbox. It's an art it's, convention. It's, it's, it's like Hollywood. It's in like a it's an animation not convention. It's, it's like, like a, a it's an art like a yeah. yeah. That sounds cool. It's in Burbank, I think. My hero yeah. Stan Prokopenko will be there. So <laughs> gotta go. I don't know who that is. Okay, well, it was really funny. I made a really funny joke. You're like, you're <laughs> bombing really hard right now. What are you doing? Hey, every comedian's got a bomb to get the respect to become lauded. So I'm just is, getting through it. Who, who is, is, he? Yeah, who is he? We already talked about it. He's one of the draftsmen. Oh, is he the oh. singing one? Or the no, no. Uh, that, 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 I should have said Marshall Vandruff and you would have been like, mm. I you would have done that, that laugh where you don't make a sound I wouldn't, and you'd have been really happy about <laughs> it. I did, Don, that, that is my favorite laugh of yours. I like that laugh. You just, you just open your mouth. It's a great reaction. Mm. And then I said, ice cream. <laughs> it's great. That's my favorite. <laughs> I would like to go to. I would like to go to San Diego Comic Con. I've never been. I've been. I've lived by it before. We've I've been. been around it. <clears throat> yeah. I hear it's just miserable now, but I would still like to go. I like to experience it. Maybe it was miserable then. What makes it miserable now? I just hear. Well, one, it's like super overcrowded, but then also it's just basically just like it's just where movie like comic movies get shown. Like, <clears throat> oh, we're revealing this. Oh, I it's that's fucking Marvel it's film, yeah. Yeah, I mean, it, it was a zoo, but the... Uh, I mean, which like is, a, can be fun, but... The I, expo floor and stuff. I would like to go to, like, the there. expo floor because I... Now I like things more, but whereas back then I would never have bought anything. Or, What's uh, so what, what is cool. the expo floor? Just if you go to any of those conventions. Have you never been to a convention? A, I've just been like, the Kansas City Comic Con. That's about it. Well, oh, okay. okay, so you've seen an expo floor. It's well, where it's, there's tables with merchandise. Yeah, like, oh, so giant, it's just, like, Artist Alley or something like that? Yeah, except, but, like, really really like expensive booths you know from like big companies and stuff that sell like crazy you know, oh that's cool street fighter okay, statues yeah, yeah. and shit like oh, that. oh so, okay yeah, yeah yeah i know what you mean now but obviously back when we went i wasn't yeah i didn't give a, give a fuck but mm -hmm. now that i have an office or whatever it'd be kind of cool to go there and i don't know like like i'd love to get there's like some comic artists that like there'd be it'd be good like kind of cool just to like use that as an ex use that as an excuse to fucking buy some cool shit yeah mm -hmm. yeah there's this uh this painting I see him at every convention I go to. It's the painting uh <coughs> of like a knight blocking like a princess with a shield from like a crown. Mm -hmm. or something. I know what it is. Yeah, I always thought that was cool. I I'm think I'm more I'm self aware enough to not put that on my wall. Thank but God. Every time yeah, I see right. it, I'm like, that's that's a that's cool. You're like that's beautiful. That's a beautiful that's painting, that. man. Can I get your card? What's my your queen. Website? Let me protect you from the stones. I'll save yeah. you, princess. It's, <laughs> I'm more attracted to the knight. <laughs> Good man. It's a well painted knight. Yeah, but that's because that's you're attracted to yourself it. and you think yeah. you are the knight. You're like, mm. <clears throat> one thing I would never want to go to though is E3. I fucking hate I'm that painting so much, just, Don. I, 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 <laughs> you hate the painting? I hate that painting. I love it. It's, it's awesome. so cheesy. Every time I see it, I'm like, that's a good painting. It's so corny. Do you have a picture of it? I I'd, can buy back and find I'd it. Probably have one somewhere because every oh, I've, every convention I've ever gone to, I've seen. I probably like, maybe I don't let check. Your, oh, is it the original or is it just the fucking like a print of it? Get ready no, for the the gayest, corniest painting you've ever seen. That is like not a good <laughs> painting. Like I, I, don't, I don't know what to tell you, man. Every time I see it, it grabs me. I'm like wow, 
That's cool. This little fuck. She's got elf ears. That's tight. She literally has elf ears. That's you know, <laughs> you know. I I can admit it isn't holding up with you guys, but <laughs> I will say, and I will not deny that every time I see it at the convention, it grabs me. I'm gonna show you some real night paintings. Oh, oh whoa! I've seen this at every convention. Every time I gotta get I your website so. again. <laughs> Every time I forget, what? I'm gonna have to buy this. <laughs> a point. I'll put myself out there to be ridiculed too. You know, you know what it is? It is. We should put that painting. It's in the there. halo effect. You know when, like, all right, you a, a moderately attractive, back. a moderately attractive person stands next to a bunch of ugly people. Well, when you go through Artist Alley and just see wall-to-wall -wall anime trite, <laughs> this yeah, is even, anime trite. No, but it's, but it's, it's even, slightly, uh, even now you're defending it. Like I. Dude, yeah. This I, is not this is not fucking pure Asian nonsense. I cannot deny the way it made me feel. <laughs> Dude, this was painted by an Asian person. I know it was. You can tell. I've, I've met him. This I've is anime. I've shook his hand. Wait, have I've, you actually? I've, I've shook his hand. <laughs> yes! <laughs> you shook this man's Was he Asian? Yeah, probably. God, I'm fucking good. Yeah, he's a short little Asian guy. All right, there's no need to bring a fight into it. <laughs> Race only, thank you. <laughs> I've got morals. <laughs> Let me find a, an actually cool night photo. There, there's a plenty. painting. There's plenty. It's, At least it someone is, with skill. It's clearly did this. far, far better than the other one. <laughs> by almost, I will, I will admit, by virtually one. every measurable metric, it is a better painting. <laughs> but I, I don't know. Just I'm, I like the colors. I like. Yeah. He shook his hat. Hey, dude, I love this no, painting. Hey, hey, okay, he extended did his you, digits. Did you? Oh, he started I, it. Yes. I just oh, asked. I <laughs> did you? Was did it? you do this up here? You were just selling this, right? You didn't actually make this, right? Are you, are you the guy? <laughs> Is it, uh, I would be besmitten if I did. <laughs> I, yeah, I besmitten. would be smitten. Yeah, wrong word. What was yeah. it? Oh, remiss. <laughs> a remiss. I would be remiss if I did not shake your hand. Mm -hmm. And get your business card. I bet you did. I did get his business card every time. I have, I have, <laughs> every time. I have like four of those. I think you love that this guy is shielding this fair maiden from the right. tomatoes. And that's me. I'm the guy and that's my hot girlfriend. That's right. And everyone respects and they, me. me <laughs> they don't they don't respect me, but that's okay. Because <laughs> she's a whore, but and they sit they're calling her a whore, but I'm saying no. My lady, <laughs> listen all, not to their all, bobs. They're all slut shaming her, but I don't care. Because I'm a big, strong knight with a shield. <laughs> I'm defending her from these insults, these poopy words. <laughs> 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 Fucking slut or my lady. <laughs> you know when you get into the castle walls, you're like, may I steal a kiss, man? She's, she's like, ah. <laughs> uh, I would be remiss if I did not if pluck did a kiss from your cheek. And you're like, mm, yeah. She's dripping with tomato. She's, she's just like, hey, I more see you as a friend. Uh-huh. And you get really mad. Are they throwing... Oh, really? Wait, are they throwing... Fr I yeah. Think, yeah, I think they're he's, throwing he's defending her. shit at her because she's a whore elf. <laughs> Oh, that is I blatantly. <laughs> and then I. Yeah. This is the this is the Asian dude. All right, this oh is yes. Really, All right, this is this uh, is this, like this race is this? commentary. Oh, right. <laughs> this kicked her straight across me. I didn't know it was a Quasimodo type situation. <laughs> All right, that's like I kind of wish there was like shit dripping off his shield and stuff. But it's, like it's his gross Japanese girlfriend. <laughs> okay. in, in, in mid was he well, Japanese? That's easy to in have in mid century Europe, and they're being racist, <laughs> and he's defending her. Yeah. Yeah, you're, this artist really put a lot of himself in there. He's the knight, and I'm. He's the woman, I'm, and you're the knight. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> it's a good painting. I defend guys. you from the racism, small Asian man. And the, them not appreciating this painting. Here you go, Don. I found the logical conclusion. <clears throat> <laughs>